after the 2008 recall, Dr. Felix Roque set out to make a change. That change came today as he took the seat for the first time as mayor of West New York. Aye. Dr. Felix E. Roque, who solemnly swear, who solemnly swear that I will support the Constitution of the United States, that I will support the Constitution of the United States, and the Constitution of the State of New Jersey, and the Constitution of the State of New Jersey, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, and to the governments established in the United States, and to the governments established of the United States, and in this state, and in this state. Under the authority of the people, on the authority of the people, and that I will faithfully, and that I will faithfully, impartially, impartially, and justly perform, and justly perform all the duties of the officer, all the duties of the, the officer, office, of the, the office, office of mayor, of mayor. <laughs> First, let me let me thank everybody here for being here today, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, and I thank the media for being here. It's a great honor, and I say the word honor because I am about honor. Moving. Uh, being now your mayor in West New York. I gotta say thank you to is the Almighty God. Yeah. And I wanna say thank you to my mother because of the long sacrifices coming from Cuba in 1967, coming to the best country in the world, the land of the free, the home of the brave, America. Yeah. I thank this great country for allowing me the opportunity to serve in the military as a colonel for the last 35 years. I always say life is good. And guess what, ladies and gentlemen, life is good. And I always say God is first for me in everything I do. I will have this Bible always next to me on the right side because I am going to do what is in your interest, not in what, not in what is our interest, okay? And that's how we're going to be leading this uh, new administration, by setting the example to all of you guys. I work for you. You don't work for me. So I'm going to prove that to you. And I'm going to make you proud of me starting today. So I, I, the doors in my administration are always going to be open. We're going to be, um, every Friday I'll be here, and one Saturday a month we'll also, I'll also be here to cater for whatever needs you have. Uh, I, will, I will always work with the word respect. Because I respect you, my commissioners are going to respect you, and in turn, you're going to respect us. And it's going to work this way. This is going to be the first time I'm going to sit in this seat today. I've been in your situation, in your location, and I've been harassed, I've been laughed at. And you know what? That is not the way government should run. Government is for the people. Government is to serve the community and to serve this country. Today was my third time that I wrote my right hand and I swore that I would defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies and domestic. In 1976, August, that's the first time when I joined the United States Army and I came in as a private. In 1981, when I became a, a second lieutenant, so today was my third time. So I, I thank you all from the heart. Uh, please, you have a friend, you have a doctor, and now you have a mayor on your side.
I came here today for a couple of reasons. Number one is to congratulate Dr. Roque, Mayor Roque, my old friend Caridad, and the rest of the team for a hard-fought victory. Uh, I know this campaign was a long and very arduous one, but that is over, and another long and arduous process will begin, the process of running the great town of West New York. And I have great confidence in the people I see before me here that that will be accomplished in a very satisfactory way. My other reason is to offer a hand of friendship to this new administration. As it comes out. On behalf of me and the rest of the elected community of Hudson County, we all need to work together. The people that are behind me here, your constituents, expect that all levels of government, from my buddy Albio Ceres and Senator Menendez in Washington, to the people like Carrie Dodd, who represent us in Trenton, to the county officials uh, that represent you and work with you, to the local group. The, the song sounds sweeter when we're all on the same page in the hymnal there. So I offer my hand in friendship to you. Wish you the best of luck. If anything I can do to make this successful, thank you very much. Take off uh, Michelle Fernandez Lopez. Take them all off. That's, that's, that's yeah. 20 uh, letters, right?